Kropivnitsky City Ukrainian Academic Music and Drama Theater named by Mark Kropivnitsky. Mike Kropivnitsky uh, is uh, his uh, outstanding or well-known uh, playwright, composer, actor uh, who lived in Russian Empire at the end of 19th century, beginning of 20th century. And uh, by the way, uh, the theater and the city itself uh, was called by uh, in honor of his name. Uh, in this hall, by the way, we see his uh, sculpture, Mark Kropivnitsky. Uh, generally, uh, his main direction in this, his career was, uh, let's to say, to show the life of Ukraine vi village and Ukraine for Ukraine farmers. So, uh, the, the theater is really, uh, let's to say, uh, central place of cultural life of Kropivnitsky city. And you, if you are somehow uh, came here, um, you must visit this place. So, it's uh, from two sides uh, we see wardrobes, but because uh, it was um, important day, uh, in the theater there were not so many visitors. <laughs> Maybe for the whole theater it was maximum uh, not more than 100 people. But uh, okay, toilet uh, or sanitary room is in perfect condition. I checked it personally. And uh, what can end more? Uh, obligatory uh, climb up to the uh, nether floor, to the first floor, because it's uh, very nice can make a lot of, of good photos and on the walls you can see uh, picture paintings of different well-known uh, Ukraine uh, actors. For example, this is a portrait of uh, Mark Kropivnitsky himself. And uh, about the hall of uh, audience hall of theatre, it's uh, erected in uh, classic style. And uh, uh, just just hall, I cannot add more. Uh, but as I told you during my visit, uh, there were maybe maximum 100 or 150 visitors. And uh, I watched uh, play uh, Natalka Poltavka, but I will edit by separate video. It's very interesting. So welcome to this theater.